Reddit. Do you have a number one rule in life? If I'm the smartest guy in the room, I'm in the wrong room. If I think I'm the smartest guy in the room, I might be. But that's an excellent time to re-evaluate my judgments of other people. I have quit jobs for this reason. If I can't learn anything from them, I'm not advancing myself. Then they never get the chance to learn from you. I'm pretty sure I don't take jobs to make other people better. Just because the majority believes something doesn't mean they are right. Do what I want cause a pirate is free. Never fall in love at the Jersey Shore. Never cook bacon with your shirt off. Ouch. I learned the hard way when much younger to never pour hot bacon grease into a plastic cup. Especially when holding the cup over your foot. Not my brightest moment either. My father is limited to a wheelchair now and he cooks bacon sitting with his face right by the pan. I saw him doing this once and told him he shouldn't do that. He said. I don't give a shit. It's bacon. Double quote. Cheating is the cruelest thing you could do to your spouse. The one I always stick to is everyone's got something interesting to tell me. Or a lesson I could learn. It prevents me from viewing anyone with condescension. And allows me to be truly interested in them. Also. I make it a point to always remember people's names. If you greet someone by name after weeks of not seeing them. They'll like you more for it. Only use four words. There's only one rule that I know of. Babies so goddamn it. You've got to be kind. Vonnegut. Crush your enemies. See them driven before you. And hear the lamentations of the women. When a store clerk tells you to have a nice day. Say you too like you legitimately hope they do. My motto is don't be a dick. Never date a girl with a tattoo of a knife anywhere on her body. Never play cards with someone named after a city. Don't lie to anyone you care about unless you're prepared to lose your relationship with them. Also. Never tell them too much even if it's the truth. No Facebook texting while drunk. Drunk Facebooking is bad but nowhere near as bad as drunk eBaying. That can get expensive. Never invade Russia in the winter. Don't die. One day. You will fail. Sorry to say this. Have any proof? He's batting one. Zero 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 so far. Never settle. Don't settle for a less than satisfactory job. Relationship. Friendships. Food. Drinks etc. Life's too short. I get the feeling you complain a lot. Never demonize the opposition. Almost everyone is trying to do the right thing as they see it. My philosophy is basically this. And this is something that I'll live by. And I always have. And I always will. Don't ever. For any reason. Do anything to anyone. For any reason. Ever. No matter what. No matter. Where. Or who. Or who you are with. Or where you are going. Or. Or where you've been. Ever. For any reason. Whatsoever. <laughs> One rule I've tried to follow. Go ahead and do it. You are more likely to regret not doing it than you are to regret doing it. Be nice to everyone. Trust nobody. Question everything someone tells you. And if you agree with them. Question it more. But when you find love. Love without regrets and reservations. Put the toilet seat down. You're welcome ladies. That's my number one rule. Never lose a chance to go to the loo. My motto in Reddit is to upvote all the hopeless idiots who get downvoted to oblivion for trying to be funny. They need it more in life. There is never an acceptable reason to treat a person or an animal badly. No matter how sure I am of my position on a matter. I'm always open to the possibility that I could be catastrophically wrong. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Wayne Gretzky. Michael Scott. Hobscrack 777. I have to. Don't have a baby and don't get put in jail. Success must follow. 
Treat everyone as if this is their only life. No regrets. That's my motto. That. And everybody Wang Chung tonight. Apostrophe. Always stop at a kid's lemonade stand. Go out of your way to turn your car around if need be. That sh t builds character. So whenever I'm about to do something, I think, would an idiot do that? And if they would, I do not do that thing Dwight Scroot. The office. Always be closing.